This is about the French Embassy tonight and the French film that we have. Uh, but uh, on behalf of the mayor and council, we have a proclamation that the mayor and council voted on, and I just want to read it uh, a couple of a couple of lines for you. It says, "Whereas the Fort Lee Film Commission and the mayor and council would like to promote that at this year's annual outdoor French film festival, for the first time expands beyond New York City, and we are delighted that they will come to Fort Lee on Saturday, September 1st. That's today, as part of the Fort Lee Film Commission's movies and music." under the stars program and whereas this event developed through meetings from tom myers our administrator of cultural and heritage affairs uh, had with the representatives of the french embassy at the hot art house conversion uh, this past january and whereas fort lee is honored to have members of the french embassy film media and cultural services program in attendance uh, at this evening's event we welcome them to our community uh, and honor not only as present day members, but also our film history link with France via the French filmmakers, such as pioneer director and owner of the Solac Studios in Fort Lee, Alice Guy Boucher, who lived and worked and operated studios here in Fort Lee, New Jersey for the American film town. And whereas Films on the Green, the free outdoor French film festival produced annually in New York City, uh, announced an additional screening this year in Fort Lee to showcase the diversity of French cinema and now therefore be it resolved that the mayor and council of the borough of Fort Lee and governing body of the borough of Fort Lee wish to recognize members of the French Embassy on this most auspicious occasion and express our gratitude for being part of our Film Commission's movie and music under the stars program and making this year's program such a success. Signed, Mark Sokolich, Mayor. So, give him a great hand here. Thanks very much. Every year we honor the legacy of Alice Guy Boucher, not only the first woman filmmaker in world cinema history and the only woman to date who built and operated her own studio, which was in Fort Lee, Solax. She did wonderful things in France and in the United States, and she was the first narrative filmmaker. So every year we honor Alice's legacy by presenting this to a filmmaker or an organization uh, that represents the pioneer spirit of Alice Guy Boucher and what she did in film history. We like to honor that. So at this point, I'd like Nelson Page to make the introduction with Richard Kozarski. If you want to read that, Nelson. Got to put my glasses on. First of all, this is an amazing plaque. And you know, my grandmother came from France, so it's especially exciting to be able to do this. And um, folks, come on over. Don't be shy. This is the 2018 Alice Guy Boucher Award presented to the Cultural Services Division of the French Embassy here in the United States for their work with the Fort Lee Film Commission on our shared film history via the pioneer French filmmakers of Solax and Eclair Studios in Fort Lee. Thanks guys, this is presented here in Fort Lee by the Film Commission on September 1st, 2018 in the first American film town, Fort Lee, New Jersey, USA. Thank you very much, here you guys go, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm Matthew from the French Embassy. This is Natalie. She works with me. And we are extremely pleased to be here in Fort Lee, New Jersey. We organized Films on the Green for the past 10 years, only in Manhattan and Brooklyn. And it's our first screening tonight here in Fort Lee, New Jersey. So it's very important for us. And thank you all for being here. I know it's Labor Day weekend. So we are happy to have all of you. Receiving the Alice Guy Blaché Award, it's extremely meaningful for us. She's one of the first uh, female filmmaker back um, in the 1910s, 19, uh, 1912, and she was also a citizen of Fort Lee, and she's a legendary French filmmaker. She did more than 600 films. She used to work for Gaumont, uh, one of the first uh, French uh, entertainment uh, companies. So we are extremely pleased to be here in Fort Lee, and to receive this award. It will be in a very good position at the Embassy. And I invite you to come and visit us. We have a French-American bookstore on 5th Avenue and 79th Street. Films on the Green tonight, we are presenting a classic French film by Jacques Demy with legendary Catherine Deneuve. So I hope you will enjoy this film, Don Quesquine, Peau d'Anne, en français. And next week, we also have another screening. It's not too far from Fort Lee. It's on campus of Columbia University, and we will present the Grosso Sound, 
and all our screenings are free, so you're all more than welcome. Thank you so much, Tom, once again. It was a pleasure meeting you last year and already working with you. Thank you, Matthew. Thank you so much, Madeline. Before we leave and get on with our program, this is, as they say in a great American film, Casablanca, the beginning of a wonderful relationship. We hope to continue to work with the French Embassy once the Barrymore Film Center is open so we can showcase, courtesy of the French Embassy, modern-day French filmmakers introducing their films in Fort Lee and also, amidst that once-a-year festival, we hope we could showcase some of the French film that was produced in Fort Lee back in Eclair Studio Days and in Solac Studio Days. So we have a very c close connection to France, and I hope we can get a sister relationship with the community in France in terms of film. So thank you so much for being here, and we all look forward to the film. And let's have a nice round of applause for our friends from the French Embassy. Thank you so much. Thanks to the Mayor and Council. <laughs>